Hello everyone. Thank you for coming to Steno 24-7. This is Steno Duchess, Duchess and I am dictating selection number 7, 351 words on the subject of punitive damages. This will be at 90 words per minute. Did you come to write? Because I came to read. Ready? Take a deep breath. And let's write. You can do this. Members of the jury, if you find that the plaintiff was unlawfully evicted and obliged to leave the premises without notice by reasons of the wrongful acts of the defendant, then you may consider whether or not, under all the circumstances, if the plaintiff is entitled to recover what are known as punitive damages. Such damages are by the way of punishment, that is, to punish the wrongdoer for his wrongful and unlawful acts and deter him from committing like offenses in the future. You may take all the facts and circumstances into consideration and then award such an amount for punitive damages as you feel would be fair and just under these circumstances. Punitive damages are allowed only when one does an act wrongfully and maliciously in the contemplation of the law where one interferes with the rights of another knowingly and purposely if at the same time he knows it is wrong and unlawful, then it is malicious. Punitive damages should not be excessive and should be reasonable. They should be fitted to all the facts and circumstances in the case. It rests entirely with you whether or not you should award any such damages. If you do, they should be fair and reasonable. The jury are the sole judges of the facts in the case, the credibility of the witnesses, and the weight to be given to their testimony. In anything that the court may say in the instructions, the court has not intended and does not now intend to express any opinion upon the facts of the case, upon the credibility of the witnesses, or the weight to be given to their testimony. Furthermore, the court instructs the jury that you have a right to consider all the evidence in the light of your own observations and experience in the affairs of life. Thank you for watching. And uh, if you can write 100, I'll see you at the next video. And if you haven't subscribed yet, Will you please come to my channel? I know some people watch this on another channel. But I would appreciate if you could come to YouTube and subscribe to my channel. That will really make me very happy. Thank you so much. And everyone have a nice day.